everyone, welcome back to the Scottish Cowboys Darts channel. Today we're going to be having a look at a light from Target. This is the new Arc light. I recently purchased a portable stand. It's not got a light, so I was looking for a light that would go with the portable stand that could be used when I'm going to hotels, going away to caravans, holidays, whatever, we in business. This is £39.95. I've not had a light like this before. I, I, I normally use the Corona, which I, I've never found anything that's came close to that yet. So I say, well, I'll try this little target light and see how it goes. So what we'll do is, I'll do a little video coming out of the box. Fit it to that board, play a game on target, dark counter. See what the light's like and see how I can see. Then I'll come back, do a little recap and tell you what I think it. This is the box for the Target Art dartboard light. As you can see, it's pretty small. So what we'll do is, we'll have a little look on the back and tell you what's in it. What's in the box? One arc light, arm light fitting and bolt, one power supply and four times power adapters for UK, EU, Australia and the USA. Some more information on here. A little picture of the light. Got a target logo, arc on the side, target on the other side, so let's open it up and see what's in the box. What I'll do is I'll just open it up and have a look at what's in the box. There you go, just comes in a little bracket, a little package just like that. So I'll stop this video, I'll fit it to the board, I'll start the video again. I'll have a little game on Target's Dark Counter app, seeing how bright the light is on the webcam and that, like you see it, and then I'll give you my ratings and my review at the end of the video. As you can see, I've got the arc light fitted to the dartboard. It's secured on by the bracket hanging at the back of the board. So all I've got to do now is I've got to put the little spirit level on straight in. Oops, dropped it. Put the little spirit level on. Make sure the board's straight. And that's us. We're good to go. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to have a game on that counter. I'll see how it reacts with the light. As you can see, the board is lit up, but the top of the board is very bright, slightly duller at the bottom, but you can still see clearly all the doubles. So what we'll do is we'll have a game. I'll put this through fast forward, step, skip through the game, and then I'll give it my ratings and my verdict. And Max on target dark counter. Please give a warm welcome to these two amazing players. Okay, let's have a look at their last matches. And let's wait no longer. Let the game begin. Kevin, to row first. Game on. Wasn't in with the in crowd, just a number in a small town. You know that hip popularity list. Well, I was like way down. Didn't dress to impress it. Didn't know to address it. And then much have changed since those high school days till you walked in. And baby, when you fell for me, I was like a new guy on the scene. Cause with you on my arm, it's like I'm strutting down the halls like a baller. Everybody's gonna stare, so I'm standing up a little bit taller. You with that double take kind of face star of the show, letting all 
shot and a match Kevin. to recap on the target arc light first of all coming out of the box very very easy to fit I would attach to any dartboard I'm sure as you can see I've got it on the Aspar board and I've got it on the portable stand now you will see that the coverage of the light is not anywhere near as good as a Corona Vision but the Corona Vision is a full 360 light. Now this is only covering the top third diameter of the board. But the light does go all the way down. I did not struggle to see anything. It is brighter at the top than it is at the bottom. But you're going to expect that. But it's portable. It's easily put away. It's easily put back in the box. Stick it in your car boot. Take your dart stand, your dart board. Would I recommend you buy this as your main light for your dartboard? I would rather, I would say I would go for the Corona Vision. If you're on a budget and you've only got £40 to spend, yes, by all means go and buy this. This is not a replacement for the Corona Vision. No way is it. But this is probably one of the best portable lights that's it's not going to take up much room. If you're taking your dartboard down and putting it back up again, this is what you're going to be looking for. The Corona Vision, I've got that and I've got to take that down. I've got to find somewhere to put that and it goes in a place where nobody can see it. But it's the Corona Vision, it's quite flimsy. It does its job when it's on the board, it's not going to come in and damage. But see when you take it off and you're sitting it somewhere, legs could bend, break. So. If you're taking your light away, this might be your only option, and I, I, as it's a it's a good buy for thirty nine pounds and ninety five pence, it's worth the money. I will tell you that. As I said, I would not replace my Corona Vision for it, but I can't take my Corona Vision with me to hotels. But I can't take this, so it does what I bought it for, and if this helps you to find a light for a portable dart stand, by all means. Head over to Target Darts, website's up there. Just put in the search, ARC, and you'll see this. You also get it for the dartboard cabinet, but this is just the standalone one for the top of the dartboard. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. Please hit the subscribe button. Hit that little like button. Leave a comment. I try to answer every comment that I see. Most importantly, keep enjoying your darts, and I'll catch you on the next review. We'll